All right, everybody, welcome. We're doing loot box specs only, so that is only pets that can summon random other pets. Uh, the five things you're allowed to use at the end of your turn are spider, stork, eagle, saber tooth, and orca. Um, no other pets are allowed when you end your turn other than sloth. All food is allowed, and then goes to the shop phase. All toys are allowed, etc. Uh, so yeah, nothing at tier one, please. So yeah, we're, we're trying to go for these two to start. I might buy sell these mice, because I don't think I'm going to need other things, but... Yeah. I don't mind stacking up some... some apples. Well, let's go. As long as I can find a kind of early one. There's no marmoset in here, which is a shame. Alright, we'll do delicious pieces. This pack is kind of old, so it's not going to be perfect for all the random other stuff we can have in. But yeah, that's fine. Alright, let's get more of this. Come on, show me one more. No, okay. Four apples is good enough. Okay. Tier two. Time to find spiders and stalks. I would love... Yeah, stalk. <laughs> I, I like stalk a lot more just because it's um better in the late game, but would have accepted either. And I think I'm just going to keep hard rolling because... You know, you're more likely to find these things early, and I would rather have more than just buying a 1-1 buff or something. Yo, that was close. Alright. Um... Buy sell mouse? Maybe? I could, but it doesn't feel good. I'd much rather just get this thing leveled up. But I guess it might be better to do that next turn, because I can at least, like, find Blobfish. Nah, let's roll. This is the best time to find these anyway, so... Yeah, there we go. Nice. Okay, that was worth it. Much prefer getting, like, another one of these two than, um... Just getting that apple, and then maybe not being able to buy them. Or at least one of them. Anglerfish, Orca, Platypus, Anteater, and the only ways to get pets not in pack. Yeah, is there anything that can summon stuff if you didn't put the stuff that they can summon in your pack? But, yeah. Alright, I'll take a draw. Anything that's not a loss. I will also take one of these. And I don't know whether to freeze pill, because if I find a blobfish, I'd love to have the pill ready, but otherwise both of those seem pretty Okay, well I'm happy to have that. Um what's the play here? Like spiders at the moment are better than stalk, but I really want to blobfish onto my biggest one for the stat gain. Yeah, I'm gonna do it that way. I'm gonna do it that way. I wasn't gonna like combine this turn because I want to at least go for tier five when there's stuff I could maybe find from it. Don't mind by selling a puppy either. <laughs> oh my god, so many headshots. I have another summon, so I'm safe. And you know what? The fact that these guys can summon a blobfish, I may have something behind it. Alright, let's get another mess. Let's get you. Definitely freezing this. And no, the spider, great. Oh, wait, I actually like it that way. So if you give me a blobfish, then you level up this guy. Unless I want one in front of this. But I'm sure it's fine. <laughs> I don't know, I maybe could have had these two at the front in front of this. Like, if this didn't get a blobfish, but this one did, then I'd still be able to level something up. But I don't care, this is probably safe. Yo, level 2 stalk. I got a spider out of my stalk. You're not going to summon anything, right? Yeah. Solid, solid. Um, do I combine? I can find an eagle from tier 5. The odds aren't great, but I think I will try this guy at least. Yeah, I didn't get it. Okay. Um, I'm going to freeze the alpaca just because if I do find, like, if I find a pill for the blobfish and level that one up and I do find an eagle, then I can always, you know, do that. Unless I stack. You know what? I am going to stack right now. And I didn't. <laughs> um, I'm actually going to do this just because I want this to all go on here. Oh, God. I'm going to waste some money here because that is a slow animation. Oh, 
Okay, well that, that fight's fine. Got the early skewer. I was really tempted to keep that um, other turtle frozen, but... Yeah, didn't end up going for that. And I don't know what to do this alpaca anymore. Like, I'm probably not going to get value there. And actually, I should have just done it with this guy. Whoops. Melon, slightly more stats. I think I'm fine on both. More chocolate. Yeah, we'll just have that ready. Good enough. Another one of these, sure. I could maybe see myself having double stalk by the end. Like, right now, I can just combine everything if I wanted, but... Ooh, but stalk is just better. Probably. I don't actually know. I need to put more, um... Like, interesting tier 5s and 6s since they actually have a uh, cool summons. He's too powerful. <laughs> Nothing can stop my frontline snork. Yep. Eagle, huge. I uh, can also buy turkey first, which I think I might do. I can't keep the turkey, of course, but like I can do that. Yeah, let's do that. And then stack you. Sabertooth, also huge. I might just sell the spider here so I can buy this for the turkey buff. I like that too much. Okay, this is all huge. You know what? Freeze everything. I'm selling the stalk. We're only having one of those. <laughs> well, maybe I shouldn't sell the stalk. I I don't know. I just don't want to risk the zebra. And if I'm selling this, then I can always buy sell the platypus. I'm selling it. I'd rather have more eagles. Yo, that was huge. <laughs> the fact that these can summon an extra thing like that is just incredible. Alright. Do this to start. Um, another eagle? I think I'd rather have eagles than orcas. So I could like, buy this first and then buy sell zebra. I think I'm going to level you either way though. If I sell this. Yeah, let's do it this way. I should level this up. What am I doing? Huge. Huge. Okay. They have a level 2 saber tooth. Uh, that's terrifying. <laughs> no. Yeah, okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Very scary. Yo. Big fan. I'll save it to fine. Uh, definitely throwing this down there. Mongoose is also amazing. And what do I have? Coconuts? Probably. I could probably get enough um stuff I want to see. I'll take a coconuts. Go that to the front. Get rid of you again. And then you're a free buy. Okay, you know what? Do it this way. I'm going to stack that deck, so I'm going to combine these. And I'm actually going to unfreeze these in the hard roll for pill, maybe. Ah, uh, nah. We can wait. I don't need to try and get this permanent, yes. It'd be nice to have, but there's too many other nice things in my shop. There's always other things I could pill. Potentially. <laughs> yeah, thank you for the extra summon there. You are looking a little bit unfortunate. Uh, yeah, I keep ice selling. I was thinking maybe I should have combined the eagles instead, and uh, maybe I should have done that. But uh, well, there'll be time to sort that out later, maybe. If I still want to. Spider, stalk, safety, tiger, stalk, spider. Should I wait? I just want eagles and this. Maybe orca, but like the odds of me finding the thing I want there is not incredible. Yeah, I'm gonna wait a turn. Are you safe here? I think he's safe if I have a gap. Yeah, okay. 
pistol because it's better than eagle now. Uh, it depends on the things it summons. Because, like, eagle can summon, like, orca and sabertooth, which can not, not exactly go infinite, but there are some good things here, like tap it, warus, lots of good stuff there. Stork can only summon from tier fives, and, um, you know, still good stuff there, but I wouldn't say it's as good. And I'm going to risk it this time. <laughs> and I regret it. Okay. I'm just going to buy sell that. I'd rather have, like, nothing. Coconut again, please. I will buy a pizza, but I'm going to roll the rest. And let's have one more time. This is going to be level 3 next turn, which is pretty big. Oh, they already have a permanent one. I need that. I need my own actual equipment. Mushrooms would be cool, but... For my Sabertooth, I just want him to be protected. Okay. I think I would rather have another Sabertooth. So, like, do I combine these and then run another one of those when the time comes? I see the cat. Just, just buy this, see where it goes. That didn't really change anything in my mind. <laughs> And there are so many orcas around, and I'm just not taking them. Okay. Um, I don't know what's best at the front. I know I can't have you at the front anymore. Let me do it that way, just to see. The same more consistent stalk wins, just because the stalk does have a stat amount. Wait, set amount of stats the pets have. Wait, do they? Does it scale it up still, then? Because I know they changed that with Eagle, but I assume they changed that across everything. But I didn't actually check. Also, very sorry, Fez. <laughs> okay, I'm stacking those. Let's get some stats on the team. We're going for double Sabertooth. Yeah, okay. I could, like, buy Cat next turn and Stew, but I don't want to do that. Send again? Hmm. I don't think I've seen any lemon, but I may have just <laughs> been ignoring it. It would have been amazing early. I don't know if it's still the best thing to have for it. Because the teams are still pretty small. Like, I've been scaling my guy quite a lot. So if I gave him lemon, he may be able to get, like, two or three, like, triggers off. It's not incredible, though. Ooh. That's fine. Yeah, yeah, okay. You know, Sabertooth, too good. I, I'm definitely investing more in this. I just need to get more levels for my backline guy. And, like, give him some stats. Yeah, stack that. Buy, sell these. Still keeping the Mammoth frozen in case I ever find a pill. There's a lemon. Um, I don't know. If I find a... <sighs> Yeah, if I find a coconut, then it's going on here, so I don't know if I want to do that or not. You know what, I'm just leveling, leveling you now. And I'm not even going for the mongoose, I'm going for the level. I'll buy a natural mongoose if it shows up, but I'll just, I'll just take these for now. Yo, I just got actual shop scaling from that. I'm gonna lose here though. Shame. Okay. We're at three though. I'm still on three HP. It's amazing. I'm going to leave Stingray, I think, just because I would um You know what? I'd rather the I'd rather the stats then. Yes, good. Um, do I do this now? Probably not. Definitely freeze you. War is Bill isn't bad if it hits some of these. Against these two, it's not quite as amazing. Yeah, just keep rolling it. <laughs> okay. Okay, I like that. Obviously not combining the oysters. Well, I, say, I say obviously, but the combining could give me another saber tooth. Yeah, I still don't know which is worth more in that sense. They... Wait, that might be bad. No, that's fine. That's fine. I was worried that, like, my further back ones were going to get priority or something, and I'd be, you know, pushed this all the way forward, but that worked out fine. 
Nice. Okay, snag you into there. Um, <laughs> do I want to go for the combo? There are two things I'd like. Oh, three things, actually. Yeah, you know what? Let's, let's combine. Another saber tooth, yeah. I'll take it. Um, if I sell this first, buy pill this, buy this, freeze that, and I'm gonna I'm gonna freeze this stew as well. Like these four things are staying. I'll just stack those, level it up next turn, buy the stew, and then maybe roll into some other thing I can play. I don't mind having an open slot though. That looks like it's gonna be fine. Oh yeah. Well, so far. I don't know what's going to happen with the stork, but I got a lot of value out of my guys, so hopefully we'll be fine. Uh, <laughs> we're not. Oh my god. So much stuff. Okay. Level you. We did find a mongoose. Um, yeah, I I'd rather protective one. So I'll just buy this. Coconuts, sell again, buy stew. Don't really need the blobfish, but I'll try it. And then I'm shuffling these around. And hopefully I'll be able to find a chameleon pill, but I'm not gonna hold out too much. I'm not gonna unfreeze my blobfish just in case. Invest more in like mushrooms and stuff. Probably. Like a mushroom one here would be pretty nice. Eagle as well, maybe, but I've been running that in my front line most of the time, so whatever's at the front is not gonna be having that, if I have a full squad at least. I mean, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm throwing it on you. You're already a much higher level. No. No, I'm, I'm going to find another thing. It would be good for now, but the second I have to put that in the front line with a full team again, it's just not good. So, yeah. How much longer am I doing lobbies for? Until like half nine, probably? A little bit over an hour? I'm probably going to take a tiny break after this one. Um, but I'll set up the lobby before I go. Yeah, if people manage to re-summon a massive saber tooth from there, like, like Stork Eagle Infinite, then God, the amount of stats people can get is just crazy. There's an eagle, so I actually can level you up. And I guess I just stack it. Might be better for me here. <laughs> Another saber tooth. I don't know. If I buy this, then I won't be able to like, you know, buy sell anything anymore. I'm gonna keep it frozen. Is it pill? You know what? Risk it. Risk this one. I will take that, so I guess. I'm gonna change order a little bit though. Venus is better than nothing, but it's already probably like the biggest thing in the lobby, so I kinda doubt that it needs it. That's, that's scary stuff. Oh, you were meant to hit that. That G, that works out fine as well. Okay, cool. I'm safe. Top two. Top two. There's the chameleon that I maybe could have used. Uh, I mean, I could just like have that at the front, but there's no point. Okay, mushroom you, because you're tiny as well. I'm gonna have you at the front. I think I'm just playing this. I think we probably are done. And I refuse to buy that. Okay. Okay, run it this way. I will try and level this backline guy, but I'm basically just gonna do the same thing. Like, he's getting... Oh. He's getting a mushroom whenever I find it. This mushroom just got overwrote, though. And how's this looking? I don't know if I can be that backline guy. 
No. <laughs> I definitely can't. Alright, fair. There's a war's pill, but it's not gonna be happening. Cheese? Do I need that in my front line? It can't currently kill, so if I give it cheese, it can one-shot that guy. Which is something, at least. Yeah, I guess I'll do that. Oh, this bluffish pill, but yeah, with... I think I think my team's pretty much done. Not much else I can do now. Okay, we traded through there, which is nice. And there's gonna be a lot of bouncing around here. I thought there's summons, but these are so big. Oh, wait, that's fine. That's a win. Okay. This <laughs> down to the last one. Please. Oh, that's a that's a nice shot. Kind of. It's not really much different to what I had before, because like, I can't actually like I have a guaranteed level and I have a guaranteed mushroom. Which <laughs> yeah. Can't use you anymore. And none of these do anything for me. I'm just buying this for the one one, I guess. And I don't want to risk it. I'm not changing the order. I think this is fine. We'll just go. Okay, well that's obviously not the best thing to summon right to the front, but... I guess it's not terrible. The breakpoints there is just amazing. Like, I had perfect lethal to kill his when it was at 18 HP, and I had mine at 19, so I managed to come out favorably for a second. Oh, this has got to be a win, right? Yeah. Hey, two in a row. Loot box victory. Very close. Very, very close. But GG's everyone. Solid game. Thank you, thank you. Alright, so everybody, welcome. We're doing snipers only in the turtle pack. That means you can only use things that can throw a rock. Um, pretty much everything has a rock somewhere in its thing. I can't um, point to everything, but stuff like Hedgehog, as you can see, it says like deal two rock damage. The only exception here is Wolverine, which can't actually throw rocks, but it does also have a rock. Um, yes, if it can throw a rock, then you're allowed to use it. All food is allowed, slots are allowed, etc. I don't believe there's anything at tier 1 other than Mosquito, so I will be hard rolling for that. And, uh, yeah. And there's one. Okay. Nice. I might freeze an apple, but I don't see myself buying it. I will freeze a mouse. And let's be the wishy-washy robots. Let's go. Yo, I didn't even have to fight. Sorry, blanket. Alright, give that to you. Come on, one more. Yay. Right, so is it just Hedgehog from the next tier? I believe so. And then tier 3 we have you, Elephant... That's it. Then we have Blowfish, and I think that's it. And Crocodile Rhino. That's it. Leopard. Snake. Okay. Okay. Um, I don't know whether to freeze mouse then. I think I might. Have, like, this is probably staying for a while, so having that ready would be nice. 20 rolls, no mosquito, let's go. Oof. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, do I combine? There are two things I could find here. And while neither would be that good yet, um, if I could get Elephant Blowfish going, like, late game, that could maybe be cool. But I think I'll hold off. I'll just make this a little bit bigger. And I'm gonna leave the honey as well. Or freeze it, maybe. If I find a Hedgehog, then I think it's more than worth having. Take another one of these. Hedgehog, nice. Right. So if anyone else has a Hedgehog, I'm probably screwed, because it only takes one to just decimate my backline, and I don't have any summons. Please, snipe this early. Good. No, it's not good. It wasn't enough. I should have bought the honey. I wanted to get like wait until I could get garlic on this or something, but I guess it was too late. Um, What's the play here? Do I roll for more Hedgehogs? Mosquitoes, yeah, this is a roll for anything. Can't use you. Spades. I miss old snail. 
some early badges coming in. Early elephants. Dolphin. I think we forgot about dolphin. But yeah, mostly just a ton of mosquitoes and hedgehogs. I like it. Okay, nice. More than happy to take a draw. And we have an elephant here. Definitely going to combine because if I can get an early blowfish, that'd be huge. And the odds aren't crazy. Yeah, I can't use a skunk, sadly. I will do this, though. And now I wish I had just, like, combined those together. I don't know what the play is. Maybe start with dolphin, but <laughs> get ready on the other one. I might give a honey to that, too. I don't know. I'd rather have garlic, but who knows if I'm going to find that in time. I'll just send it. Might stack that next turn. Honey onto you. Roll once, and hopefully that'd be garlic. If not, then if I find another high-ish tier sniper, then I can just combine mosquitoes and then place it. Nice. Okay. That was there. Snack you. And we did find garlic. Excellent. Okay. Throwing that on the elephant. Still going to leave it to the back. And yeah, we're going to be looking for bluefish, I think. It's fine, right? Yeah. <laughs> nice. Got worried. I saw they had like a little bit more attack than I had, but trade's a trade and I will definitely take it. More than happy to throw that down. And come on. Please. Give the garlic. Okay, good. So I might... Yeah, I think I'm going to try and level the mosquito as well. Not because I really care about it. Plus, its ability might actively be bad if there's many blowfish around, but... Uh, yeah, having the combo so I can maybe find an early crocodile, leopard, or maybe a rhino. All potentially useful. Oh, we don't find here, right? Yeah. It's a win, even. Cool. Okay, and that's a, that's a level. So do I want to go here? I have like twice the of actually finding a sniper. Or not, actually. There is a snake from this tier. Which I do like, but I don't actually know how useful it's going to be. Like, for me, it's like these three that I care the most about. I think I will do it now. Yeah, let's just get that leveled up. Crocodile, perfect. Okay. That's pretty big. Like, an 8 damage snipe to the back could be very helpful. Like, there or just destroy them. That would also be pretty useful, like killing it one shot. Yeah? There's a lot of good things to hit, though. <laughs> I don't know what to do. I want to go for Elephant Blowfish, but I haven't found any more yet. Like, I haven't bought my level 2, my, my second level thing for the Elephant, and I don't know whether to go really hard on trying to find that to make it work. Okay, start with this, because I want to see what it turns into. Um, there is Mammoth Pill here. Some Mosquito, maybe? I don't mind having a load of money to do that. Yeah. Some Mosquito, Mammoth Pill. And then I think I will be buying this elephant. Yeah, buy the elephant. I'm just going to roll the pair for now, because there is definitely other things I could be looking for. Leave the Rhino. It's fun, but I don't think I'm going to make it work here. And maybe that way? I'm so lost. Yeah, parrot's not allowed, by the way. You have to... Yeah. No, my honey. It was so close. Okay, level you. Things I can't use again. I can freeze that, and it might be helpful, though. And I like all of this. Okay, good. I do want to find garlic or something for there, so I have more protection from random start combat snipes. But yeah, there's going to be a lot of crocodiles around, I assume. Maybe not yet, because it's you know, still kind of early in tier 5. Solid hit to the back there. 
I think this is also going to die before it gets too many triggers off. Yeah, it didn't get to, like, get farmed from the elephants. So that's good for me. Okay, nice. Another hedgehog. I think I'm probably done with you. In fact, am I done with you now? I think I might be. I also don't know if to go, like, double down on the elephant or not. Like, this is staying. These are staying. And I'd, I'd rather my other fourth thing to be, like, a leopard, but who knows when I'm going to find that. Uh, let's sell this for now. Play a second one of those. Get rolling. Uh, buy this. Freeze that. Send again. I definitely need a different backline, though, because this is always going to die in one hit to other people's crocodiles. Like, this right at the back is probably the best thing I can do, because it might soak up two. Oh, they didn't have any. And their backline badger actually kind of screwed them over. Excellent for me. Okay. Stack that. I don't trust the state, because I feel like my team is just going to explode. And how many mosquitoes are still around? Enough. I, I feel like the snipes are still too low damage. I don't think Melon's worth it yet. I think I will try a combo there. It didn't pay off, sadly. Snake is interesting, but I think I'm just going to buy pill you and keep the elephant frozen. Uh, let's do it that way. I just want to guarantee that my bluefish isn't getting shredded by other people's crocodiles. And yeah, Wolverine isn't a sniper, by the way. I'm going to lose for it. Ouch. Okay, cow's a nice buy. I think I'm going to prioritize that onto the leopards. Not incredible yet, but maybe I'll get there. And sushi. Yeah, like these, these four are staying. I'd love to have another crocodile or something. Instead of the hedgehog. But yeah, who knows. have a scroll. It's a lot of leopards. <laughs> okay, I do want to have the snake teams are doing. I was too afraid of these just exploding somewhere. That's also very interesting. Level 2 Rhino. Could definitely work because most of the teams are very, like, tiny. But, yeah, if it ends up getting destroyed by snipes at the start, then <laughs> less incredible. Oh, snake, why? Still 1 HP, but we are alive. What do I do? I want to buy sell the cow, but I don't know if I can just get rid of the hedgehog for it. I'm doing it. Alright. Uh, give one to each of you. Buy other that. And just keep rolling. This might be my final turn, but I don't want any of the rest. No snake either. Okay. Well, let's do it that way. Again, you can soak up like a couple of hits, so maybe it's worth it compared to that one, but who knows? Snake isn't it, dies for any attack score. That's the thing. If it can survive and still have a pretty big like thing in front, then amazing. Because, you know, level 2 snake does 10 damage, it's not a shot, which is solid. But yeah, I'm, I'm too afraid of anything that I have on my team just dying before they can get value in the fight. There's way too much stuff going on right at the start. You know what? I'm doing that. You're probably getting hit by other crocodiles, so why not? How scary the rest of the thing's getting. This is the problem. Like, there's... Actually, you'd be pretty good. But yeah, the mosquitoes are what scares me, because then it makes it makes me feel like uh, having melon just isn't good. Just ignore it. Okay. I like that snipe, at least. I just did double trade. And yeah, I did forget I need to find garlic for my blowfish. I normally don't do that, but if I'm going to be running against a lot of other people running the same kind of squad, then I probably do want it. Frontline steak. 
I'm gonna say no, you're too likely to die. I'd rather it be melon, but I don't want to buy melon either, so I just won't give you anything. Like crocodile. Yeah, sure. Yeah, okay. Well, chocolate is huge. I'll try and get you to level 3, but I don't really see it happening. Um, chocolate is almost definitely going on the elephant here. Instead of you. And my leopard is still too tiny to be worth, like, anything. It's almost better than crocodile, but it's still not, so. <laughs> yeah. Close. Oh, perfect. So what? Garlic, you... I mean, stack this first, just to see what we get. Leopards. Do I level you up, then? And garlic that later? Or do I need to garlic it now? I don't know which is more important. This is interesting, but it actually might not be a terrible play in case it gets hit by, like, massive leopard hits. Um, I'm going to take a risk, and I'm going to do this to start. You know what? I'm doing that as well. Okay. If I can survive, then I think having my blowfish at level 3 is probably going to pay out more than, you know, trying to do some other weird stuff with my other, other guys. Yeah. He's getting skilled. And these aren't allowed! Snow, please! They don't snipe! Oh, fine. Okay. <laughs>